Today we're talking about a very, very action movie came out in the mid 90s. It's called Spitfire. Spitfire. Sorry. I'm trying to sing the theme song, but I know I'm saying it wrong. But um, this is a pretty cool movie, man. It really is. I mean, it's like an action comedy like movie. I would say it's comedy because it has it kind of like gives you that style of that movie Fast Getaway. Remember Fast Getaway with Corey Feldman? You know, it's kind of like that style, you know, but they used the James Bond spoof on it, you know, not, not to be taken seriously or anything, you know, it's like, it's like the comedy elements work with it with thanks to Tim Mas Thomas's, um style, you know how he is, but um, the movie's about, it's also with Lance Erickson, he plays like this James Bond type of character, he's making love with his woman, um, a couple of other agents come in, get involved, they want the launch code for the Ukrainian launch code. And um, they pretty much killed his killed his woman. Lex Erickson gets away, and then he try to try to um, he meets up with his daughter, that the daughter that he never knew about. Found out that his daughter is a gymnastic. She's performing in Rome. She's a gymnastic team, the U.S. gymnastic team, traveling in the tour to showcase gymnastics for the contest. And um, <coughs> Lex Erickson kind of calls up to his daughter. You know, does it give give her too much information about who he is and what's going on? But kind of like. Give us some details about going through these different missions, and they later on get Tim Thomas's character, who's like a reporter, gets gets like spying on her, trying to kind of get a story, trying to see if the U.S. team is like selling drugs or something like that. But then he ends up helping to go to help her with her mission. While meanwhile, you got the father who got kidnapped by the evil agent, kidnaps her, kept him alive for a while. You know, it's just just to use him like 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 a ransom bait for a while, just to. See if she get the daughter to give out the information about the Ukraine launch codes and stuff. As, as she goes to a mission, she meets her, meets her with the different contacts, and you get the comedy elements that each contact she meets is pretty much related to her. So kind of like the movie trying to say that that Lance Erickson's character, who's a spy, like a James Bond type of spy, like he has different love child in different countries. If that's what it is, but um, I thought it was kind of funny though. But um, but they order hope it out. Trying to help her complete her mission, but each of the love child end up dying because of the evil female agents and her, her and her minions, you know. And um, this girl is totally amazing. Like her martial arts skills are like flawless. It's like you could consider her to be like the female version of the movie Jakarta. You know what I'm saying? I what I want to do, I need to be on her is like, oh my god, this kid could have done so much more. You know, she could have done more action movies, but um. I just thought it was epic, in my opinion. Like she, could, she got martial arts skills. This kid could fight. And um, anyway, when she goes to the different missions, later as the movie progresses, she gets captured by the female agent and her reporter friend. And then she ended up trying to show her where, the, where she hid the key that she got from her contact from Hong Kong. And then she knows that this woman's gonna kill her, like how she kills her mom. So she ended up. So she ended up like throwing the key in the sewer while the evil agent tried to pull out a gun. The reporter who was able to unhand unhandcuff himself, thanks to the help of, of the of the girl's father, the agent, um, unlocked the cars, you know, comes comes in and just in time to save the girl, push the evil agent down down the stairs of Hong Kong, like I mean Athens, excuse me. No, not Athens, excuse me. I think it was Hong Kong, yeah. And um the evil agent got arrested. She, the minions were able to be stopped, and then the father and the reporter is gonna like fly her to Athens for her gymnastic tournament in Athens for the championship. And you know she just performs there, and you also got like little little um steroids bust in in meantime while the uh, the um, Ukrainian team trying to like set her up, and they they were able to be stopped. You know, and you know it's just like. Though at the end, the woman visit her mom's grave, grave site, you know, was just paying respect to her. But all in all, this movie was excellent. I actually enjoyed the movie. It was action. It was like comedy drama. In the, it's, like, it's a lot of comedy drama, though. But it was enjoyable, though. It was enjoyable. So Spitfire, 1995, very rare. If you like that last Eric you like Tim Thomason, you like a kick-ass chick, they can totally kick-ass, then you definitely gonna love this movie. Peace, guys. See you later.